you tuned in today for a drill of the week, this is something a little different. There's, there's, this is not from practice, uh, but it is something that was a result of several practices. Um, 2022 conference season, we start out our season 0-2 in a year that we had really high expectations. Uh, we'd come in with a 10-3 non-conference record, had played very well, expectations were really high for us, and, and you're, you're staring 0-2 in, in a rugged, rugged SEC. You got Missouri coming to town, 13-2, and 2-0 two. Two in the league. And that one of those two wins was against the number one team in the country, the South Carolina Gamecocks, who we all know would eventually go on to become the national champions. Missouri was coming off defeating them at home. So we're catching a really, really red-hot Missouri Tigers team. It's our rival game. Uh, we've been playing these guys two times a year uh, ever since the SEC went to 14 teams. Throughout this other 0-2 start, one common theme kept coming back up in our, in our post-game autopsies as well. There wasn't enough physical touching going on with our players, between players and players, players to coaches, coaches uh, to coach. There just, there wasn't enough oxytocin happening. We'll get to that in a minute. But we were, we were in a funk, and we've all been there as a team. So we said, hey, let's make sure that every opportunity we get, that we're helping a teammate, we're picking up, we've got a high five, we've got a pat on the back, somebody gets knocked down, we're picking each other up. So along with focusing on executing passing and catching better in practice, we turned to focus to something too that we were entirely in control of. Good or bad, we were going to make sure this particular game, uh, we were going to be charting it. And like we've said on hundreds of other videos, players will do what you chart. So you better be careful what you count. So we were going to be counting physical touches in this game. We're, we're two minutes, a minute and a half in. We're up four to two. Uh, you see one of uh, physical touches getting ready to happen right here. You see Sam and Jersey coming together in transition for a, hey, add a girl. Add a girl right there. Sam, one of our get back people, sees that Missouri's not flying it up the court in transition. Hey, here's me a chance during a live ball to go reward Jers for doing something on the other end. Jers, quick point. Quick point to Sasha. Yes, yeah, Sasha, I see you. Yeah, they're not coming at me. This is my kid. You got her. Hey, let's get another quick touch in here. Hey, there's quick. Hey, Amber, who was our get back person? Going from get back, her kid's probably not even in the half court yet. Amber, hey, here's me a chance to get Jers a good little high five. So Jersey, in the course of four steps, has gotten a touch from Sam, Sasha, and Amber. Cortisol is the hormone that's released when, when things are bad, when you're in depression, when you're down on yourself, when you're down on anything. You, our bodies produce cortisol, and it makes you feel blah, and it, it makes you feel down, and, and there's nothing you can do about it. It's biological. The reverse of that hor hor hormone is called oxytocin. That's when you feel good. That's when something gets you the pump up. That's when these high fives. So we talk about a high, high five game. I'm not talking about physically high, I'm talking about in the number of count, counted touches that we have. We got, a, we got somebody on the floor. Matt dives in there, all right? I'm not a big everybody dive on the floor coach. Uh, I want somebody to pitch it to or what the ball squirts out. I want somebody, but I, I want everybody's attention to it. Look, all, all 10 eyes are on this. We got some, two people coming up off of the bench. I'm sorry, more than that. Three, four coming up off the bench, encouraging, get after it. Then we got tons of clapping going on. Lots of evidence that oxytocin's being given to Mac here. Hey, Mac, I got you. Sasha helping her up. Jers, come in there and get it. Amber on her way. Let me get in there and get away from me. Here comes Sam getting her touch in there. Nice job. Good job. Hey, anyway, back at you. It's contagious. One leads to two, two leads to three. I even give Missouri a little bit of credit there. They high-fiving each other on the way out too. 50-50 ball, okay? 50-50 ball. Mac again on it. Whistle blows, so we stop. You can tell everybody turned around and look. What do we got? What do we got? Oh, let's go get Mac. I'm on my way back. I almost forgot. Oh, let's go. Sasha does forget. Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. I'm going to get you now. Good, right there. Bam. Two touches. Good spacing. We're not talking about that today, though, but I do got to point it out. Good spacing. Sasha hits a big shot, all right? Sasha's already going to feel pretty good about herself. She just hit a big shot. But, man, it doesn't hurt. Who, who made that pass? Hey, great pass right there. 
Let me get that touch to that person. Matt, racking it in transition. A lot of energy. She's probably got a lot of, a lot of physical touches have led to a lot of oxytocin here now. We've, we've taken a four-point lead, got a little bit of separation. She racks it, gets us to seven-point lead. Good energy on the way back. Hey, I got you. Matt, hey, I'm looking for somebody. Hey, good pass. Next possession now. Hey, we go on the, they go on a little run. Tie this thing up. Okay? They go on a little run. Tie this thing up. Need something good to happen. Mac racks it. Sam ready to catch and shoot. Bang. Mac, big celebration. Amber, big celebration. This early in the game. Okay? It's not the game winner yet. Mac, Mac's acting like it is. That's good. Gets the crowd going. A little defensive stop. Go get them. Timeout. A lot of energy coming in out of the timeout. We'll pick and roll. Not a live ball, so we don't have to go down and help her. Got to get up yourself. Leads to a timeout. This is a great one. Boom, 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 boom. We're counting them. We're big. Everybody's up. Everybody's out. Everybody in there. Checking in and out. Hey, I got you. Who you got? Hey, I got you. Touch. Hey, let's go. Mac. Somebody left Mac hanging. I think we ended up with about 600 touches in this game. Sam tries to get one. She's in the arc. No big deal. Let's get her up. Four people helping her up. Nine-point lead. Starts growing. Big play. Keeps the ball alive. Tough on the floor. Get back. Hey, great job. Way to keep it alive. Little thing. Leaders. People that, right here, that's a little thing. Jersh, great job keeping that ball alive. Didn't get the rebound. Knew you couldn't get it. Kept it alive. So we have oxytocin. They have cortisol. All right? So we would talk about that. Hey, let's give them some cortisol right here. Let's give them a reason. Little, little roll rise. Hey, great job on the roll. Great job on the rise. Hey, good pass. Hey, get back in transition. Good run, late run. Jersey. Again, we're not talking X's and O's, but C's. The opportunity to get to the nail. We've got everybody's attention. We've made enough shots in this game that they've, hey, don't leave them. Late run right at the rim. We get a two-footer. Let's do another timeout. 12-point lead in the first half. Of an early season, whether we said it or not, somebody around here on social media probably said, hey, this is a must win for these guys. Smiles, touches, people that weren't in the game, people that started the game, people that are hurt. Uh, people that know, you know, hey, I'm a red shirt, can't play, uh, not, not eligible to play, uh, coming off an injury, out, involved, in. Can't even got to the bench yet. Big 14-point lead early in the first half. Good draw dish. Big shot. A lot of celebration. Mac, again, Mac's an excellent celebrator about other people. Mac does something herself, you, never, you can never tell. Somebody else does something good. Man, you look for that reaction right there. Get you a point guard, get you a racker, get you a leader that celebrates like this when you do something good. We talk about this some. When the ball's dead, what's your team doing? We've got some dead ball time here. We're, the, the referee's over there telling who the foul was on, probably having to explain what it was. Take advantage of that time and say, hey, listen, after this, we got to make sure we get back in transition. What defense we in? Who we got matched up? Hey, Blackwell and Frank, they're going to be on the same side. It could be this action. Made a couple threes. When she made them, Mac celebrates. The crowd goes wild. Oxytocin builds up in Riley Langerman. She's excited. She's not depressed. This is Amber Ramirez. Okay. See, this, is a, this kid is over the last, at this point in time, over the last four years, percentage wise, was one of the best three point shooters in the country. But she's hit two in a row. 99 times out of 100, Riley's next passing that one to Amber. But because she's hit two in a row, oxytocin coursing through her veins, we're shooting that. Bam. Amber, who could have been mad, rightfully so. I'm open. Why didn't you swing it? No problem. Bam. Great shot. Mac, again, high celebration mode. Riley, confident. Guess what? Gets Amber pumped up. Another three. Okay, we're up now. That's going to put us up 20 at the end of the going into halftime. A little too much air guitar here. A little bit too much air banjo or whatever we called it. We don't get back in transition. Okay, this is at the end of the half. They hit a three. 
All right, they hit a three. That was right after that play. Chance for cortisol or a chance for oxytocin? Nobody's happy because we didn't get back. We don't get the shot. Look what we did before we even go to the locker room. This is a fifth-year senior. This is a, this is a third-year starter. We're over here talking about it, too. Look what we do. Get together right now. Amber, that's probably not oxytocin coming out. All right? But rightfully so. Everybody comes together. We don't, we're not off running down the tunnel. Everybody gets together. Hey, it's okay. Hey, but we got to make that could have, that could be the three that we don't need. This showed me as a coach that we had a team that valued every possession. That wasn't going, ah, coach, but we're up 20. We can be cool. They were upset about it. We hadn't said a word to them. We haven't even gotten to them yet. Okay? You can tell by us, our oxytocin, we're probably not doing it. We're probably giving too much cortisol off here. Okay? When you get a, a game film, we are all susceptible to watching actions and defense and rotations and who did what and trying to assign the blame game. If you're in, in a point where you're struggling as a team sometime during the year, you got a big game. Okay, this was a must win. Because I, I don't remember who we played next, but I can guarantee in our league it wasn't easy. One and two is a whole lot different than 0 oh and three. So instead of going to the practice gym and instead of, you know, focus on something like this. It's not something you can do every game. We call these things Olympic moments. You can do them about once every four years. <laughs> maybe a little more often than that. But maybe every two years, you can go in and say, hey, guys, our physical touch number is low. This needs to be a high, a high, high five game. Hopefully this uh, departure away from an actual drill uh, will be a good chance for you to recenter yourself as a coach and maybe point something different out uh, that will help your team win a, a big game and a, a must-win game sometime for you during your season. Thank you.